お前はもう死んでいる。何おわたくびでギゼブWhat's up, Tots? My name is Ordinary Potato, and today we are playing a One Punch Man. This thing is brand new. A One Punch Man game on Roblox. I've been waiting for a good one without just two races, Cyborg and Superhuman. Now we got one. Oh my gosh. What is this in the background? Anyway, we got a new One Punch Man game, and it has four different races. Cyborg, Superhuman, Esper, and Ninja. Yes. They have the ninja race. And I'm the ninja race right now, so I'm going to showcase that for you guys. Uh, but first, let me tell you what they're all about. So for the ninja and the superhuman, they both favor in strength. So they have more strength than cyborg and esper. And esper and cyborg, they have more energy slash stamina, whatever you want to say. They have more energy or stamina than the superhuman and the ninja. So, oh my gosh, the lag. What is what is all of this blocks everywhere? What is this? So, first off, I am going to show you guys the ninja showcase. So, let's get right into it. So, for the click, we have basically you grab your sword and you do a lightning fast slash. It's so fast that you literally cannot see it. I'm not joking. See? Nani? <laughs> Legit, did you see me move my hand? I literally just grabbed my blade. If you have watched One Punch Man, you know why it actually attacks like that. So, uh, for all you One Punch Man fans, you know why it does that. And for the first move for the ninja race, we have its ninja star throw. So we throw ninja stars with our Z. And they have a huge explosion. So there you go. See that explosion? I killed that thug over there. And then I click. You didn't even see me slice, did you? It's lightning fast. And then for our next move, we have a zoom, or I would say like super speed. And you press that, and you're very hard to see, very hard to notice, but you able, you are visible. You're not invisible. People can still see you, but you're just extremely fast and very transparent. So I'm just flying across the map and it's hard for them to notice me. You see that guy just used it and it was kind of hard for me to see him, but I did see him. For our next move we have a spin and if I go ahead and use it, it's like a slice, purple slices. And you just go in a circle and it has a pretty good hitbox. Not super fantastic or anything, but it is good enough. You can sneak up on them with this X. So if I go ahead and sneak up on this dude, you need yeet. And I use that. Ooh, he, could, he didn't even have time to react. I already killed him. I already killed him, he's just dead. He was gonna punch me, but then I just sliced him to death. GG fam, GG. And then for our next move, we have a jump star throw. So, like the first move, we throw stars, but except we get high in the air and it throws you right below us automatically. So if I go ahead and press V, all these thugs, dead. So I do basically like a, I don't even, I, I don't do gymnastics. I don't know what that, what it's called, a somersault in the air and it throws down these freaking huge like curves and it kills everything you go around but here's the creator right here let's, let's go ahead and kill him so um uh we gotta we gotta think of a combo so oh he called me what you call me weak okay okay then okay i'm done with you. let's go oh let's go Killed me. I was gonna try to demonstrate the next move on him because he killed me. Okay, for our next move, we have a dash, a really quick dash, and it's just like the click, it's impossible to see. It's one frame, you go from one place to another. So if I go up to this thug and I use B, I slice with my blade and I go right through him. And you go pretty far from your actual distance. I thought it would be maybe like 10 studs, but it's more like 20. So if I use it on the, it has a really long cooldown. So 
kind of hard to use again. That's why it does so much damage and it one shots. So let me just go through. Nope, still on cooldown. But that is the B move, which is the last move on the move list. And if you go over here to this person named Snow, they actually give quests. So there are quests in this game already, which is pretty nice. So we don't just gotta kill NPCs over and over again. We kill specific NPCs and we get XP for that and yen. So I have defeat 10 thugs, so let me go do that. So the thugs spawn over here, I was already killing them as you can see, so we're gonna wait for them to respawn. He freaking just gathered them all over there and destroyed them. So here's the thug, it's gonna lightning fast kill him, didn't even see that. Jump up, bam, ninja stars. Oh, I missed, what? I have perfect 20-20 vision, how did I miss? There we go, seven more thugs to go, just destroy that one overkill. And then the next one, we're just gonna Z that dude dead. Easy. And then here we go. C. Spin. C. Spin. And then we got the Z. Kill that thug. Easy, boy. Easy, boy. And then here we go. Overkill. Oh, I wish I would have gathered them. I wish I would have gathered them. We need to kill two more. And then we'll finish our quest. What I don't like, though, is the quest GUI goes away really quickly. Really quickly before you see what you earn. So. The last one, I got 15 yen and uh, 15 experience. 10 yen and 15 experience. And then now, we're gonna head over here and if you go to the right, there's the Sea King. I don't know if you guys watch One Punch Man, but there is a character named Sea King. You'll see him in the future. I don't want to spoil it for anybody. But let's kill this dude real quick. He has some pretty nice animations. Pretty cool. Not like normal punching animations. He punches the ground because that just, it just makes sense. It makes sense to punch the ground if you're a giant. You don't want to punch the air, then you won't be able to. You won't attack anyone. So let's do the Z, and then let's try to let's get him really low, and let's finish him with this. Oh, okay. Finish him with this V, and he's dead. He's dead. We murdered him. Uh, and it actually says above the uh, NPC's head their threat level. If you don't know what that is, I'm not gonna say it. But if you do, then you know. So the threat level. On this is Wolf. Go ahead and kill him. And Wolf is is it's really low. <laughs> it's really low and it's not a high threat. And if you go over here to this NPC named Ryan, you click on his face. Click on his face. There we go. You can buy weights. So I'm gonna buy those. I'm gonna buy this too. Or I can't buy that. You have to be expert to buy that. And it increases your magic, I believe. And I'm gonna go ahead and get this weight, and it makes you stronger to use the weights. So getting them weights is something you want to do. And you got the larger weight right here. Just lifting them weights with the owner. Yeah. Getting ripped, boy. And it makes you stronger, but I can't get any stronger because I'm already max level. So that's very unfortunate. I just wasted my money. I just wasted my money. But anyway, that is all for now for this game. In the future, they will be adding modes. To each race so maybe like the ninjas will get like a super speed mode where they'll be like insanely fast and really hard to keep up automatically like the move and you don't even have to press it and then maybe uh, superhumans will have like some other mode I don't even know there's a lot of stuff that can be that can be put into the game and nobody really has the guesses and buildings can actually be destroyed but you actually have to have a strong enough attack so when I do that over and over again no matter how much times I do it it won't work there is a move for the cyborgs that actually destroy buildings but in the future every move in game will destroy buildings so that's gonna be pretty cool I like the uh, interactive environment I use Z on this whatever I do it won't do it it has to be the freaking blow up sun move. so let's go ahead and we're gonna we're gonna sneak up on somebody we're invisible right now so let's go ahead and Oh, oh, let's kill the creator. You got this, you got this, you got this, you got this. Ooh, 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 come on, man. Let's go, let's go, boy. Oh, he's holding a rock, he's a superhuman. He's holding a rock, he's gonna destroy us. Uh-oh, let's try to end him. Die! Okay, let's, let's get on top of him. And then, here we go. No, I missed. No! I'm so bad, I'm so bad. Oh, he missed. He missed. Come here, boy. Come here, boy. Come here, boy. Come here. 
Come here. Come on, man. Come on, man. Okay, this this dude, he's running. I can't. Well, anyway, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to give it a like and subscribe. And I will be definitely making more videos on this when it comes out in the future. And maybe some updates for the testers and stuff. But this is in the testing stage, by the way. You can't play it now, so I'm not going to have the link in, in the description to the game. Maybe I will, so you guys can favorite it. So the future. But anyway, I will see you guys later. Peace. Goodbye. Aloha.